Today we're going to be going over the shortcut and the hotkeys. So what you want to do is go up to Window, go down to Preferences, and from there you'll have all these settings that you can change, but you're going to want to go to Shortcuts right there. And then there'll be all these commands that you can select. The first things that you're going to want to set up are your push, your draw line, and um, your follow me, and your move command. So what you want to do is just, let's look for uh, move, so M-O, tools, move right there. Right now I have it set for W. So you can change that to M if you want. I think, I think originally it's set to M, but I actually made my materials pain M. So if we go in Windows material, yeah, I have that at M. The reason I changed my move tool to W is that the W is on the left-hand side of the keyboard, and from the left-hand side of the keyboard, I can select my modifier keys. So if I go materials, oh, let's go back to the move tool. So tools move, and that's W. The reason I do that is that I want to be able to reach all of my main tools without having to move my hand across the, the uh, keyboard. So, and I can still hit all my modifier keys in the space bar uh, to go back to the selection tool. So I can hit shift, so I could actually make the move tool, um, let's say if, if, if I wanted to make, well for instance I have the draw tool, the line tool as draw, and that's D so I can hit it from there. But then if I wanted to make shift D a command, um, let's do draw a circle. If I wanted to make that um, shift D, then I would just hold down shift, and then I would hit D, and that'll give me plus uh, shift plus D. And then you want to hit the make sure that you hit the plus sign, and that'll add it. And you can have more than one, uh, so I could also make it um, control D, and I can add that as well. So make sure that you use these modifier keys and then you can have every single possible command you can think of just from the left hand side of the keyboard and you won't have to be moving your hand back and forth across the keyboard use those and you can get all of the main commands in and you do want to make sure you set these up right away because it's going to increase your productivity double to triple okay and that's it for today